Hey everybody, how you doing? It's Rodney Samuels here again, licensed real estate agent and professional wholesaler. If you're into wholesaling real estate, anything real estate investing related and other money-making ventures, do yourself a favor, subscribe to my channel because I put out content on a regular basis. All right, also don't forget to get your free uh, lesson on wholesaling real estate that I put together. It's a free instant download. I should put, I'm gonna put a link in the description of the video. This video I'm making, a real quick one, is something that came to mind. It was a problem I used to come across when I first got into wholesaling. And it was um, dealing with fake buyers, okay? Fake buyers. What I used to do was, when I had a property under contract, what I used to do was I put my contract, put my property up for sale on Craigslist. And Craigslist is just open to the public. Anybody can go on there. And these people would contact me as buyers and um, pretty much waste my time, to put a long story short. They would set an appointment with me to go see the property, so I'd run over there, show them the property, and um, if they would show up, some of them didn't even show up. Um, if they would show up, they wouldn't even put an offer in on, the, on the property. No offer at all. Um, a real buyer will pull in, put an offer in on a property, especially if they come out there and they see the pictures online and they know what the price is. When they come out there to see that property, they're going to put an offer in on the property. A lot of the times they will give you an offer right there on the spot at the property. Sometimes you'll get a buyer that wants to go home, crunch a few numbers, but they will get back to you within a day. All right. The people off Craigslist were not doing that. A lot of them were not doing that, okay? And it frustrated me a lot. Frustrated the hell out of me. So, I smartened up and I built my buyers list off of real, legitimate buyers. I went and I found a source that gave me buyers that actually had bought properties before cash in my neighborhood. And I deal strictly with them now. I put them on my buyers list, okay? Um, I suggest you go out there and you find those sources that will give you the um, the real cash buyer so that you don't end up wasting your time like I did in the past okay I have a course that I that I um, that I sell that gives you all the details of where to find buyers um, you can actually go to a, a website called um, freedomsoft.com I mentioned that a couple of times and I have a letter that I send out to cash buyers that gets me a crazy response rate it has my phone ringing off the hook with real cash buyers all right, so do yourself a favor, stock up on real cash buyers and um, so that you don't have to deal with people on Craigslist, all right? Please give this video a thumbs up if you find it useful, and I will see you in the next video. Take care.